hey guys what's up welcome to the latest lecture of the stat pro classes now today we are going to discuss about the curved beams fine so what are curved beams you see the arches yes those are the curved beams so a lot of a time we uh, these are actually the special kind of beams uh, we use in stad about this uh, so stad has an option to make the curved beams so in order to make the curved beams i have already made four nodes i'll be showing you uh, the different way in which the curved beams can be made so for making the curved beam the first step is geometry add beam add curved beam fine then this the cursor will come with a curved beam sign you have to select the two nodes and then immediately it asks for radius of curvature and gamma angle we can say the radius of curvature be say 10 meter 10 meter uh, or one can say 5 meter 5 meter and gamma angle now you will got to know what is gamma angle let's do it ok so I have added a curved beam just see uh, then I will just changing the gamma angle and you will be observing what change and see it will be self explanatory actually gamma angle I set it as 90 degrees ok 5 sorry 5 gamma angle say 180 degree ok and this thing 5 gamma angle is uh, 270 degree ok so let's see uh, let's get the front view just uh, see the curved beam gamma means here z is equal to 0 means the y x plane fine so shift n let's display the beam number uh, let's display the beam number and uh, we'll be actually watching this whole thing just see what it happens I have added here the gamma is equal to 0 degree and it forms in the y x plane just see in the y x plane and the next time uh, the next one that here I had found was in 90 degree it forms in this x z plane and this one in that plane and this one in the opposite plane fine so in different gamma angles actually justifies the plane in which we want because the beam may be protruded outward or inward as per the artistic view so hope uh, you have enjoyed this lecture please don't forget to subscribe my channel see you in the next lecture